experiences, different ideas, different values, different expectations, limitations, capabilities, all of these things. And what happened is, is we forced them to sometimes disregard that and be like us, right? Share our weaknesses, share our strengths, be like us. And you had to. If you're in that top half of Adrian, you had to do it. Because what did I say to you if you didn't do it? I said, my way or the highway. And guess what happened? Some people took the highway option. So then what did I say? Disloyal, job hopper, right? Because you wouldn't adapt to my work style. Now, what we're finding is there's a different group. This 16 to 26, 27 year old is very different, right? This is the group that when they started to enter the workforce, all of a sudden there's enough millennials that guess what? We don't have to adapt to the extra ways because there's some folks in there in the top half who understand us, who are willing to support us. We're now at a point where 30% of the workforce is made up of the millennial generation. Okay. In the next five years, by 2020, half of the workforce will be millennials. 10 years from today, you all know how fast 10 years goes. 10 years from today, we'll be at 75% of the workforce being millennial generation. They will have infiltrated every level of business. They'll be running organizations, owning organizations. We'll be working for them, working with them, around them. They'll be everywhere. 